So let's dive into that quickly. Jose says, rather than paying $200 per month in medical insurance, 200 auto insurance, people will simply save Bitcoin and want, okay, that's a different way to look at it too. I love that approach, honestly. <clears throat> Jose says, rather than paying $200 in medical insurance every month, $200 in auto insurance, all the different insurances that you pay every month, people will simply save Bitcoin. And when unexpected expenses arise, people will be prepared with the greatest money in world history. Yes. And not only for insurance, but I think people will start doing that in every different aspect of their life, where whether they need new tires on their vehicle, whether they need to replace their deck, their roof, if you're somebody who owns a house, you know that every 10 or 15, what is it, 15, 20 years, you're going to have to replace that roof. Instead of waiting for that to happen, why not start putting $100 a month into a Bitcoin wallet? And when that time comes in 10 or 15 years from now, you have that wallet that's specifically dedicated to your roof fund. And who knows what's going to happen in those 10 or 15 years? Maybe you only have to spend a tenth of your Bitcoin on your new roof and you have the rest to do whatever you want with it. I just feel like that's a much better strategy in terms of what people currently do in terms of putting into a savings account or just waiting for it to happen.